around in your back, flat in your hips. Just all these side stations working shapes. If you're having trouble then holding these shapes from the floor, you're definitely going to have trouble on the bars. Go ahead and same thing in a push-up shape. Same round shape in your back, same flat hips. Rounder, even rounder. I like this one. I said this in the last lecture, uh, but I'll repeat it again. I get to travel in a lot of gyms for recruiting. The number one hands down thing that I feel like makes great athletes is expectations. The clubs that are producing the best athletes have high expectations. They might teach their tap swing one way and somebody teaches it another. They might have their arms one place on their twist and somebody has it another. I think technique's important. I have a preferred twist method. You can ask me questions about bars before I have a preferred method. But the more important thing is that whatever method you choose, you stay on top of it until you get what exactly what you're looking for. And you always expect a little bit more. I believe you can do that in a positive way. You can encourage them to get there. But it doesn't mean that you encourage them and say something is good enough. It's always trying to get better. And that's what makes a great coach. I do